Moving to Malaysia, Yu Songrong is a student in the Bayan Lepas Tsiji Preschool, and his favorite Jingsi aphorism is Love the mountains, love the waters, cherish the earth and its resources. At six years of age, Songrong's passion for recycling is almost boundless, and when he stacks and ties off bundles of newspapers, he always gets professional results. Even better, Songrong has a hammer and he knows how to use it. Yu Songrong is only six years old and has already discovered a knack for handicrafts. He loves to bang on things with his hammer and turn trash into a toy. But it's not just for play, Songrong works for a higher purpose. This is an amusement park, this is a charity box, this is a swing, and this exercises our feet. This is a fountain. I wanted to build an amusement park so that kids have some place to play. If the police see people dropping litter, they will pick it up. Songrong is always building little toys, so much so that his mother marvels at his creativity. Once I realized he really likes to make toys out of recyclables, I saw it as a form of creativity. It's not to save money, I just noticed that a lot of things I wouldn't pay attention to, he will make something from. And he's better than I am. I really admire him for it. Extending the lifespan of items through reuse is an idea Soron got in his preschool kindergarten class. Every Friday, the group does their recycling together. Ms. Ning taught me how to tie up newspapers. My favorite Jingzi aphorism is, love the mountains, love the waters, cherish the earth and its resources. Because that talks about the earth. If we didn't have the earth, we couldn't live. So we need to protect the earth. Love the mountains, love the waters. For Songrong, this is not just a slogan. It is a mission command, and Songrong is fearless about executing it. Sometimes he will tell us how to recycle certain items, the process for it, and such, how they sort things every Friday. Only people who appreciate what they have can give, and only people who give can be happy. Recycling is one form of giving, and when little hands receive the wisdom and carry it home to bigger hands, everyone can sense the deep truth behind this little pathway to joy.